Big up to my dog Tyrone. It's my long time brethren, isn't it? Man's known it since I was like eight or nine. So man's known it for like 20 years. First met up at uh, my Taekwondo club. And uh, yeah, we just became friends from there, innit? Funny enough, my man actually lives on man's estate. So we grew up together, innit? So when I come back down to the ends, man will always make time to go and link him, innit? Yeah, if we're both free, obviously, innit? So boom, he just sent me a voice note which inspired me to make this quick little video, innit? And he said, just watching my level of hustle on that has inspired him to just want to go for it. Because see, as I said, us man grew up together in it here on the same estate. So he saw when I was on the wrong path, he seen me turn it around and you get me, make proper moves and you get me. So he's saying that that's inspiring to him in it. Yeah? And he said he just wants to go for it in it. So he must have some ideas or some dreams and that in it. Blood, you see in this life, yeah, you need to go for it in it. Yeah? Stop wasting time, stop procrastinating, go for it. Whatever you've got, whatever little idea you've got, whatever dream you've got, you need to pursue it. Stop thinking about what people are gonna think about your ideas and that, yeah? You do what you want in your life, yeah? Remember, you come into this world on your own, you know? So when you drop dead, everyone else is still gonna be living, you know? Yeah? When I say you come into this world on your own, obviously you might have a twin or whatever in it, yeah? But you understand what man's trying to say, yeah? You born alone, die alone. When you die, the world is still gonna continue, yeah? So don't worry about what people are gonna think. People are gonna come in and out of your life, yeah? You need to do what you wanna do. Stop thinking about what people are gonna think and that. This is why a lot of people don't make progress in their life because they're scared of what people are gonna think. Oh, if I start this YouTube channel and I say this and I say that, then certain people might not agree with it and that, yeah? Forget them. If they're not on your playing field, forget them. Forget them. Too many people in this world have not progressed, not made no progression in their lives, they've not done nothing with their lives and that just because of fear of failure as well, as well as people thinking bad of them and that. Forget that man. Do your thing. Stop procrastinating. Man like fucking AMS. If you know what AMS is in it, a big YouTuber, whatever, and yeah, boom. My man started his YouTube channel, I think in like 017 or something like that. But he said he was procrastinating for a whole year. You know, if he never started that YouTube channel, you think my man would be where he is today? Same like Kevin Samuels. Big up Kevin Samuels. I don't see. I don't know his backstory or whatever in it. Yeah. But if my man never started his YouTube channel and that stepped out of his comfort zone, because please believe the people them that know AMS, uh, Kevin Samuels, and all these other YouTubers, please believe the people them, their family members and that they're probably laughing at them. Don't get twisted. I've got family members, they probably laugh at me behind my back, or they was laughing at me behind my back. Oh, Jay's an idiot. Oh, I'm making this YouTube channel, talking this, talking that. But, rah, my man's brought out a book now, you know? Rah, my man's actually doing what the average person's not doing. You understand? Like, man's actually making money off of my thing now. So, you just gotta forget about what people, uh, people's opinions and that, man, and just do your thing, man. That's why, man, jumped on this YouTube thing. Blood. Even though you are black, even though you come from a poor background, yeah, you come from a rough, a rough environment, yeah, you can still make something of yourself, yeah. Stop letting your skin colour and the media and what people's opinions of you dictate your future and that, yeah. You are the master of your destiny. So, yeah, man just out here trying to prove a point in here because there's a lot of YouTubers out here. A lot of people talk on YouTube channels and talk about, yeah, uh, you know, you can be the best version of yourself. Yeah, do this, do that, or whatever, innit? But where them man their receipts at? Cause it's easy for man to jump on YouTube and they might in themselves actually have changed their mindset and be on a positive thing or whatever, innit? But where their receipts at? Cause anyone can jump on YouTube and talk this thing. Man's the proof. You can come from a, a poor family. Man used to be on fucking free school meals. Man's mum couldn't afford to give man's pocket money like that. You think, what? You think man, man could get... Uh, new trainers every month from my mother. Nah, nah, nah. I could buy that from um, buy that myself due to me hustling and that at school. But again, man had to go out and hustle in school because man didn't have no money from man's parents like that. So if you come from a poor family or whatever, and yeah, you can make it. I'm the fucking proof. Stop listening to the media. Stop listening to all this nonsense about if you're a black person, you have to work twice as hard as a white man. That's bullshit. 
That's bullshit. Some people will say, and I always say this as well, innit, yeah? You have to generalise on that, innit, yeah? And the minority does not disprove the rule or whatever, innit? But at the same time, the reason why a lot of black people fail is because they all got the same mindset, the same victim mentality. Fuck, man's taking the wrong fucking turn in. Look what you lot making me do. But anyway, shit, man, I have to try all the way around now, you know? That's the thing about Northampton, they've got a lot of long roads and that, man, that don't lead to Norway. Anyway, so they say the minority does not disprove the rule, innit? So people will look at me and say, okay, all right, cool. You're one person, you've made it out of the ends or whatever, you turn your life around. But what about the majority of the black people, them, that are still stuck in the ends, they're still victims or whatever? The reason why they're like that, the reason why they ain't made no progression in their rascal life is because they've got the same mindset. I'm telling you right now, change your mindset and the results will come. Not right away, though. <laughs> Not right away. But change your mindset, work hard, You'll be successful. It's so simple. Anyway, a man's out, yeah? There you are, you're done.